Good morning. It is last day of 2023. Woke up today and the uh, weather is looking the same. Literally the exact same shit that we've seen for the last few days. Like, does Sweden not have sunshine? I don't get it. I mean, I know we have the same issue back home, but I've actually seen the sun a few times this winter. Anyways, <clears throat> we have breakfast, which I once again did not film. Uh, and we're getting ready. It's cold today and it's Sunday. It's also, I think almost places are closed, except for like grocery stores, restaurants, cafes, etc. But we're going to do some exploring. So we both got on the new pants that we bought yesterday. And we are going to seize the day. Hopefully, it honestly would be nice if it snowed like it did. That was yeah. quite lovely. We'll see how that goes. So let's just get ready to the slave, yeah? Okay, we made it to Södermal. Yeah. And to be honest, it's not really much going on here. Guys, like, I don't know. The buildings so far isn't really anything in particular, but that's cool. We are just gonna look around as you can see. It's definitely colder today. But this is this weather is nothing compared to home. <laughs> like Oslo is freezing, man. Uh, Yana has found herself a cat uh, <laughs> that she just be friends and I don't know what's going on. But we're gonna walk around a little bit and then we're gonna get some lunch. <laughs> so I'll see you guys a little later. How come you go? Let me tell them that. After a lovely lunch, we decided let's catch another bus, which we're so happy that we decided to purchase a 24-hour ticket because it's fairly cold today and we did not want to stay outside for too long. So we headed to the first subway station, which was the central one. As you can see, gorgeous mural. We took it to Kungstrigorn, which I'm pretty sure I'm saying in a little bit of a Norwegian accent. Uh, and from there, we checked out the mural and then got on the bus back to the hotel. And we realized the uh, public transportation system was fairly easy to navigate. The only thing is that you have to beep the ticket in the front of the bus, which is a little bit different than home. Okay, guys, we're coming to the end of the year. I freak it out. Yes, so we need to, because we bought a few bottles yesterday, well, one and a half. <laughs> 
So it's currently 5.34 and we have a dinner reservation at 8.30. Yeah. Yes. So what we are going to do, we're going to start with this petite Chablis. So that while I straighten my hair and we do our makeup and all of that, we can drink. And hopefully we'll be done early enough so we can pop the bottle. We'll do that. I feel like we are starting at a reasonable hour. Yeah, we're starting. I guess. Well, it's over two yeah. hours ahead of time. That's true. That's smart. Okay. Let's see how this is. We have champagne glasses because we don't give a flying fuck to go down and get some fucking actual wine glasses. Period. Okay. Thank you. Oh, sorry, I drank. I didn't swallow. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> not bad. No, this is not bad at all. Okay, first step here is striped. Yana has lost her foundation. Yeah. Okay, I am done. Hair is straight, jacket, dress. It's a dress. It's on. Wearing this dress. It's like a blazer bedazzled dress that I bought from Zara like lots of years ago. Wearing these boots. Mm, put on some lipstick and some earrings and yas. I think I might just do a little bit of hairspray because ooh, I can see the baby hairs living life. But other than that, it is good. It's been a few years since I wore, wore this dress for New Year's, but I won it before. But like, I feel like we should just not get a new dress every year, so we gotta use what we have sometimes. <laughs> Mm, but yeah, that's it. We're gonna pop the bottle now because Yana's hair is done. And uh, yeah, it's getting time to celebrate for before we go for dinner. Wow. <clears throat> Hockey brother. 
Oh, wow, happy new year, guys. Oh, 2024. We have January 1st, starting with a Monday. Girls are a bit tired. It got fairly late last night, not necessarily because we came home late, but we were just here chatting away. Uh, but we had breakfast downstairs, which once again did not film. <laughs> Now we're just here packing it all up and uh, getting ready to just check out at 12 and go to the airport and just go back home. I saw that it was snowing like madly back home in Oslo so it'll be interesting to see how the landing is going to go and it'll be very interesting to see how am I going to get home from the airport. <clears throat> so. Stay tuned for that. Come on. It's over now. We're tired. We're tired. Mm -hmm. There it is. 